everybody, I'm back. Um, I had not realized I'd probably be able to do this as soon as I have, um, but it looks like Andy's a little delayed at work and his mother's gonna be bringing me, Emma, which is great, um, but she's not here yet. So I wanted to real quickly um, do another video. Um, this time I just wanted to talk about weight loss alternatives and that kind of thing. Um, the reason why I'm talking about this is because after I had my baby, I, well, with my baby when I was pregnant, I gained probably about 40 pounds total, um, maybe less than that. But I know I gained a bunch after I had her when I was nursing, because when you're nursing, you're super hungry. So anybody who's ever nursed before knows that. And I also had a lot of postpartum depression issues. Um, that happens, you know, more recently, uh, or more often than people are willing to talk about. Um, nowadays, so that's something that was a uh, hindrance and it did make it easier for me to turn to food And I think that's a lot of people's problem, you know when they have that type of depression or they turn away from food It's one or the other um, but our poor bodies <laughs> They're the ones that get the worst of it But anyhow, um, I like to run and running makes me feel good about myself and makes me feel good about life and it's one of those chances for me to actually just kind of think things through and get out of my own head a little bit. So it's really a very relaxing experience for me. So I would never stop running. Um, I just kind of slowed down for a little while and I think that's why one of the reasons that added to the depression was one of the, the also problems that I had was that I just wasn't doing that anymore. I would walk at lunch and I've always walked at lunch, but I, you know, recently, like within the last month or so, started picking back up the running again. It just wasn't something I was interested in doing. Um, but. I tried weight loss alternatives. I tried um, True Fix and True Control, which work great, absolutely great. No cravings, um, you lose weight like crazy. There's a lot of caffeine though, and I'm a high energy person already. I don't need more caffeine, I don't need more energy. I need less energy. So I kind of switched to, um, I lost a lot of weight. It went down to like past the amount of weight that I gained pre-baby. Um, and then my um, body started just staying still at 145, which is great for somebody who's five, seven and a half. That's, that's a good weight. I mean, I'm not wanting to be a skinny mini. I just want to be able to run and my knees not hurt. Um, but I couldn't handle the caffeine, so I had to go off of it and I wasn't running and because I didn't have to do anything with it. I just ate better and drank more water and lost all kinds of weight and it was easy peasy rice and cheesy i just walked at lunch and that was all i did that was the only exercise i did i swear um this go around i tried uh the gen 2 um which is still true fixed true control type thing it's still the um the true vision is the brand name um it gives you energy and everything and i took it with i think it's true control I believe, which is the one that's just balancing your sugar and all that. Um, it, I don't know, like I haven't tried it since I started running again, but I'm really scared because it does have a little caffeine in it, not as much, but I'm still scared because I'm so high strung all the time and I stay that way. Um, so I kind of like backed off on this. Maybe I'll try it again and I'll get you guys back up to, to date with it. But so far with it, I didn't really lose any weight it wasn't the same um but that was to be expected that's the way it was reviewed by other people um but what i'm taking now i'm taking this more for sleep than weight loss um my body will even itself out with the running it'll i'll go down to a decent weight eventually <laughs> Till then, my knees are screaming, but <laughs> it's a whole different story. Um, but I am tried. I'm trying this stuff called Calitrin. Um, it's. I want to say. It is expensive to buy it, but what it is is it is. Um, it is a um, naturally occurring thing in our body already. It is collagen, which collagen we lose over time as we get older. We lose more and more collagen and that's why our skin starts to wrinkle. Um, that's why we start to have like joint pain and arthritis and that type of thing. They're all been linked to collagen. Um, so this is like a good supply of collagen, but collagen also 
has the added benefit of relaxing a person and helping a person to sleep. So I take this before, like about a half an hour before I go to bed, and I, and I still take other sleep alternative type things, but I don't have to take as much, and it's not as often. Um, I haven't really, I lose a couple of pounds here and there, but that's because of running, so I'm not really worried about the weight with this as much as I am the sleep benefits. And I feel like my skin looks better. Um, I've also been taking Nutrafol, um, which is a hair, skin, and nails combination, but that was because I have a lot of thinning hair up here. Um, and while it made the hair that grew out healthier, I don't feel like it filled in any spots and it's like so expensive. Even if you did like a subscription, it's $75 a month. That's too much for somebody who's got a small family and, and I, try different ways of saving money on it and it's just it just and they send you little glass bottles every single month and that's just too much i feel like one i can't deal with all those glass bottles um i'm interested in finding something like um tati westbrook's um halo which is um she has she sells these little packets that are refill packets and you can get on a subscription and you keep using the same bottle but you get your next month's pills in a little pouch that's much more sustainable and not wasteful. Um, I feel like that's a big deal. And then they're not super expensive. Um, I signed up for something else that was super expensive and I'm trying to dispute the charges because they just charge so much for it that it's not good. Um, so I'm not, I'm not really happy when it comes to that right now. I should have just stuck with Tati. <laughs> I'm an idiot, but you know, um, I just wanted to try whatever was out there so I could tell you guys about it, you know, partly and, you know, try things for myself. But that is my review so far of Kelletra and I have been taking it for almost a month. I've only got like a little bit left in the container. I you like how I open things up like a maniac. Um, but I, so far, I feel like I feel better. I don't think I'm going to be a skinny mini on this stuff and that's not what I'm going for. I'm not 20. I'm 43. I'm never going to be a size two again, and I'm perfectly fine with that. I just want to be able to run and not hurt my knees. Um, that's the most important thing to me. And also, I'd like my skin to look better, and I feel like it has. So, I mean, any number of circumstances could be doing that. I also am very big into makeup, which is something I hope to be able to expand on in the future. Um, maybe once things get going really well, I could start um, recording some tutorials for makeup. Um, if you guys have any skincare questions or anything like that, let me know. Um, I do have lots and lots of uh, tips for skincare. I am very, very into taking care of your skin. It's so important. Um, one skincare tip I want to leave you with before I end this video is I wash all my makeup off with with coconut oil on a makeup removing wipe. And that is the best thing ever. I have these little dry patches on my skin that are right under my eyes and they disappear and go away completely as long as I'm using the coconut oil to remove my makeup. If I stop using it or if I like start running low, then I'll notice they come back because I start like lightening up on the amount I use. Um, but I'm gonna keep you guys up to date with everything as far as what I decide to do about the hair supplement but currently I'm pissed off <laughs> there's no better word for it um, but definitely I recommend this Calitrin stuff um, get the big deal like I did um, I had to put it on a credit card which I don't even get me started on that um, but it has made such a good impact on my life I know that I ache because when I run because my joints are bad and I'm older and everything but it's not as bad as it could be or it hasn't as it's been in the past so I feel like it's making a difference and I also feel like I'm sleeping so much better and I feel like I'm just kind of more you know mellow so there's all that um can't think of anything else to say uh makeup today is all pixie um and mascara beauty um and the lip well, it just faded off a little bit, but it was a lip stain by um, Ardell. And my eyebrows look really bad, but we'll 
get into that later. But I hope everybody has a fantastic week. Um, maybe I'll get to record again if Andy ends up working late. But love everybody. Subscribe, share. Um, if you have any questions, please, 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 down below in the comments section, ask me your questions. Give me ideas of things you want to see in the future. Share with everybody. Um, have your friends tell me what they want to see in the future. But thank you so much for being here. And I love you all to pieces. See you later. Bye.